Oh my god, it's all the way up here? Holy shit, Delphine, I don't... <laughs> Maybe I'll meet you there, Delphine. I might just meet you there. I'll take the carriage from Whiterun up there. If my analysis is correct, the dragon buried near Kynesgrove will be the next to come back to life. Okay. Oh dear god. Wait, does she ever talk while, while we're traveling with her? Oh shit, she's really not that fast at all, is she? Okay. Oh, here we go. Alright. We'll see if she says anything interesting to us. Come on, we've got to get to Kynes Grove. Yeah, yeah we do. Jeez, this'll take a bit, huh? <laughs> Alright. Sure. Oh look, the beautiful birds flying around. I love it. Good. Jeez. Look. Oh I gosh! Don't think, come back! When we had last left the last dragonborn, they were deep inside the terrible dingy bowels of the ancient Nordic ruin of Ustengrav, where strange things had occurred long, long ago. Strange placements of tables and benches. It was a very bizarre place. But even more bizarre was that it was the resting place of the horn of Jürgen the Windcaller, or Jürgen Windcaller. It, maybe it was their last name or a title, one of the two. But nonetheless, it was an item that the Greybeards wanted the Dragonborn to recover in order to prove to them the Dragonborn's prowess. However, upon reaching the final chamber, covered in a strange little bit of water and some statues, that erupted forth from the reflecting pools, it was discovered that the horn had gone missing. In its stead was a note, a missive left addressed to the Dragonborn, one that said to return back to a small town that was a little familiar, the town of Riverwood. This is the Elder Scrolls V, Skyrim. Welcome back! Woo, there we go. <laughs> we are very cold out here. And you know what? I said that I would look into resting here. Right? Getting all nice and rested up. But the problem is... Oh gosh, look. We, we've also gotten chilled out there. <laughs> because it's so cold out there. Good lord. Let's wait for our health to regen there. There we go. Alright. But look at this. The double bed requires straw. Where do you even get straw from? I have no idea. I thought that maybe it was from, like, the bays, the bays, the bales of hay. <laughs> yeah, that's what you call them, the bays. The bales of hay out here that you could, like, harvest them every so often. But it seems like that's not the case. Maybe you buy it from, like, a farmer or something. Or maybe it's something that only your steward can bring in for you, which means, holy shit, we should be looking for a steward with uh, utmost haste. Nonetheless, let's be off for... Well, let's see here. How about Solitude? And then we take the carriage from Solitude all... Ooh, gosh. Leave it all the way down to White Run, And then we go all the way back to Riverwood. Oh my gosh, it's been a long time. Oh, has it really been that long? I don't know. We've certainly traveled pretty freaking far. That's, that much has got to be said. But I don't think it's been... Well, that said, it has been like 50 hours. <laughs> 60 even, right? Some would say 60 even. There are games that you could beat several times over in that amount of time. <laughs> Good God, we're going to be playing this forever. Let's get these butts out of here. Beautiful. Okay. Up and over here. Activate our whirlwind sprint as well. Very nice. Can I jump it? Cool. Right onto a little hexagonal chunk of ice. Beautiful. You love it. Okay. Past the very eerie house. Very eerie and ominous house. All the way through the mystery murder swamp 500. Right. Very cool. You know, I'd love to see in the future you be able to utilize vehicles in some way. That'd be very, very cool. 
More so than, like, you know, the vertebrate situation in Fallout 4. Or even the flight that you get here in this game, right? At some point. A little bit different. Oh, gosh, it's still at it, huh? <laughs> we should probably just uninstall it, right? <laughs> we really probably should. Uh, but... Yeah, I'd love to be able to uh, use all sorts of vehicles and, and shit like that. Like, also, maybe steer around like a carriage or something. I don't know. Oh, shit. Thank goodness. I've been wandering alone for so long, I thought I'd never see another soul again. Oh, God, you're in the murder swamp, a frightened woman. Calm down, tell me what happened. I was kidnapped by these bandits weeks ago. They locked me up in the towers near Mistwatch. Mistwatch? I managed to pick the lock and slip out while the guard slept. But now, I'm completely lost. Can you help me, please? Yeah, there's a town nearby in that direction. Yeah, you can really just see it up there. <laughs> How lost could you be? Come on, you just look up and you see solitude. <laughs> What's your render distance set to? Jeez, do you need help getting there? Oh, thank you. But I should be fine now that you've shown me the way. But those bandits have to be stopped. Oh. They're at Mistwatch. Here, let me show you on your map. Wow. If you can stop them, you'll be a true hero. Oh, did you know I'm also the Dragonborn? I feel like I might also be a bit of a hero already, but... Oh, okay. Did she even mark it? I didn't get, like, a little update or whatever. Is this it? No. Where the hell is Mistwatch? What? How far did you travel and wander? What? Oh my god, where is Mistwatch at? Hold the fucking phone! Where is Mistwatch even at? Is this even a real ass place? Is it some place we've been to before somehow? Has our thing not updated yet? Are we still waiting on a like map update? Is that it maybe? Let's see. No, cause look, I'm updating there in the top left. I'm getting thoraxes and everything. Where the hell is Mistwatch at, dude? Felglow, Fort Greymoor, a mole, Mistwatch, all the way here. Yo, how far did she fucking go? Oh my god! Honestly, it's amazing you didn't run into a settlement from going all the way down there up here. Jeez, you can't help but run into a settlement, or, at the very least, get captured by some other bandits! <laughs> Holy shit, she traveled like half of Skyrim! Oh my god! Jesus! Alright! Sure, yeah, I'll hit it up in, like, a million fucking years. Jesus! I think you're safe from those bandits. By the way, welcome to the murder swamp? <laughs> You might want to take a take a little breather in Morthal over there. It used to be full of vampires, but uh, I helped uh, fix that. <laughs> Good God. That's wild. I've never seen anything like that before. Gosh, we're running into all sorts of fun and cool little, um, what do you call them? Random encounters on the road since we aren't using fast travel. Holy shit, you really miss out on them, right? Good lord. I remember sort of being amazed by by that same thing in Fallout 4 when they came out with like the official version of their, uh, what do you call it? Of their survival mode. And I was so taken aback by how many things like, because Fallout 4 didn't launch with survival mode. It was added in posthumously. <laughs> and... Uh, I enabled it as soon as it came out because my character by then I'd already been playing the shit out of the game, of course. <laughs> but I enabled it, and I was so surprised by how many, like, random weird-ass encounters in the wilds that I was just, well, encountering. Good lord. It was such a shock. Honestly, I really, I really enjoy them, right? They're really, really cool. Okay. They even started adding in, like, a whole bunch of neat ones into Fallout 76. Do you like how I occasionally bring that up, that, that, I, that I play that still? <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Let us equip our fun pick here. There we go. Get into this. Should probably eat, because our picking is also very, very slow. Let's eat some delicious salmon steaks. There we go. Wonderful. 
I did do the uh, work of depositing a whole bunch of stuff that Ilya was carrying around into... Wow, look at all those birds up there. I really want to foose them! Oh, if only I had some levitate. Ilya, can you just, like, shoot me up there with magic or something? Good God, fortify your strength, Ilya, and just send me flying into the sky and I'll scream at them. <laughs> oh, yeah, Ilya, you can just turn me into, like, a dragon. <laughs> I'll, I'll pull out my magicka, my, like, flame-spewing attacks. <laughs> just fortify your strength. Throw me through the air. I'll shoot out my flame blasts and <laughs> give them all sorts of fusro das and shit. Well, just Foose Rose for the time being. Oh, but, oh shit, aren't we about to get the Da? We're about to get the Da, real soon, I think so. Oh, what a thrill. I'm so excited for this. It's gotta be said. Okay, let's see, let's go whoosh our ass over here. Now, wasn't this water messed up last time? How fucking bizarre, right? How just absolutely bizarre. Poof! Oh, oh shit, I'm so fucking dumb. <laughs> Should we wait? Should we just cross? Ilya, I'm going through. Let's see. Is this cold water? This water isn't even cold. Wow, you'd think this would be freezing water, but it's not. Holy shit. This is some nice water, actually. Ooh. There's like a little darter dude. Oh, it's gone now. Okay. Well, let's head on over here. Let's see. Where is the carriage dude? I think we could... Wow, you can really even see it during the day over there, that big column of light. But I think we will travel over to Whiterun and then rest in our room, our own house at Whiterun, right? That makes sense. Okay. Let's see. Is it the horseshoe? Or is that just a stable? Well, maybe they tend to put the carriages right next to the stables anyway, right? That could make sense to me. That, that checks out. Here we are. Mmm. I need to get some more little trees. <laughs> you know, the ones that you hang up in your car? Because especially now that we're going through this area and we're going to be going through, like, Falkreath areas at some point. Ooh, I, I want to smell them, dude. I want to smell the pine. Just grab some pine mm -hmm. cones and rub them all over my shirt before I start recording. I've got your back. <laughs> in, in the middle of the recording, I'm like, Oh, God, carry? I'm covered in ants! <laughs> They're going into my mouth! Help! <laughs> All right. Let's see. Mmm, <laughs> tastes like reduced stamina. <laughs> Fuck. Let's see. Let's deposit this. There we go. Good, good, good. Thank you, Ilya. Oh, shit. I don't want to deposit that. We almost have enough Jazz Bay grapes as well. There we go. And of course, we also want to deposit our heavy as hell ore. There we are. Good. Good, Read good, good. Oh, look, is this straw? Can we get straw from, like, the stable lord? You probably want someone else. I'm just the stable boy. Do you know where I can buy straw? I take care of the horses. Oh. And the goats and the chickens. Ugh. And the garden. Damn, Jesus. Uh, how do you like the farm? I hate it. Everyone feels sorry for me, so they don't treat me too bad, but... Sorry for what? Both my parents were in the Legion. There was an ambush. Good God! Dad said she'd feed me if I could make myself useful. I'd take care of the animals, run errands, that kind of thing. I guess it could be worse, but I'm sick of sleeping outside with the horses. She makes you sleep oh, outside home. with real the parents. horses? Not this. Oh my God! Well, I'm not ready for this just yet. Good lord, we need to remember that this kid is out here. Holy shit, this is like a Cinderella fucking thing, Until huh? Until next time. Good god. <laughs> Jeez. What was her name? Is this her? Can Katla? I help you? You make him sleep outside? You got like two buildings here on this compound. We could always use help picking crops if you need a few extra coins. Oh god. Oh, my vision is blurring. Oh, it's Talk not to good. Gaiman if you want a horse. Okay. Or Catla if you're looking for work. I oh, his name you. is Gaiman. That's how you pronounce it. Got business it. at the stables? All right. If you're heading up to Solitude, you should stop to check out the view on your way. Friedrika? It's a good one. Is this about the stables? My husband Gaiman handles the business. Oh shit, some leaks. I'll take them. Wonderful. Okay. Work Jeez. hard for the future. Maybe we should Indeed actually 
take a nap in uh, fucking <laughs> solitude. I don't know, dude. We're we're not looking too great. Let's see, up and over here. There we go. Oh, this is really just the worst effect. Thank goodness they did not uh, have this carry over into Fallout 4 when you got sleepy. At least I don't think so. Right? I'm not even sure if you can get sleepy in Fallout 4. I think the whole usage of sleep in that was to allow you to save, right? Which when we play, maybe we'll get a mod that lets us go by that. Because that, although I'm fine playing like that on my own, it makes it weird for <laughs> when we want to stop playing a ride? for a video or something. I can take right? you to any of the whole okay. capitals. Let's go on to over go? to... White run. Well, we quick save before we did this, right? Climb and back, and we'll be off. So, in case we get like permanently tired or whatever, we get like debilitated. I think it is. Sun feels good, huh? Can I? Too bad I can't like rest in the back of this. Jeez. Poor Ilya. She's wishing the same thing because she has to fucking run all the way there. <laughs> All right, how are we? Am I permanently... I'm famished, I'm chilly, everything's going wrong. Okay, but well, alas, we are still alive. Okay, we can do it. Let's see, we don't... We don't have a debuff, do we? Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm fine. I am fine. All right, let's eat some steak here. May as well, because even when we sleep, that'll continue ticking. Okay, oh look, the textures are weird. That happened before, didn't it? I think the solution was for us to just, like, zone in and out. Or a quick save, quick load. Should be fine. Alright. Let's go on up in here. Jeez, look at the door. Not looking great either. <laughs> it's it's the effect of us being sleepy. We're just so sleepy, everything... The, the like, model that it uses is the far away distant one. <laughs> Okay, Breeze home. Here we go. Wow, this town is very empty at night. Jeez. Okay, here we are. Good, good, Long good. Long life to you, Thane. Let's have a rest inside of our apparently freezing cold house. Okay, let's go for eight hours. Why not? There we are. We should check here for some salt or something, shouldn't we? I'm not sure. I think we must have some. Oh, look. Okay, yeah, we get one of these. How about we get some health or stamina? What should we get? Let's get some stamina for some carry weight. Right. All right. I think we can invest these perks whenever we so damn please, right? Hmm. That said, would be nice to continue building up toward this, right? We need to get that eventually. Heavy armor weighs nothing. That'll be such a boon for us. Hmm. Let's see. As well, 60 on that. Okay. Deadly Bash, also pretty good, I think. We can increase our blocking effectiveness more. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking we build up towards something fun, right? Or we could get a point in, like, Illusion, right? Yeah, let's get a point in Illusion here. We can build up toward this. Seems like a good move. Because Illusion's going to come in handy. In a major damn way. Alright! Great. Oh, very well rested. Finally. Vision is no longer blurred. Yo. In real life, I've never had... I've never been so tired that my, my vision has blurred or darkened. That is a terrifying prospect. Like, holy shit. That seems really bad. I think I would sooner, like, collapse than have that happen to me, right? Like, I've had it to where, like, certainly in what high school, need, I was falling asleep during classes and stuff, just sitting there trying Still to here. stay awake. And that was fucking bad. But what never did my carry? vision, like, blur, I don't think. I don't think so. All right. Let's see. Let's get this salmon meat. There we go. Let's get going. Wonderful, then. and we'll cook it all up. Oh, jeez. Weighed down by salmon. Cool. Alright. And then, what else do we need for the veg stew? Or the veg soup? Tomatoes. 
How do we not have any tomatoes? What's up with that? Okay. Nonetheless, let's get the salmon steak going. Here we are. 30 something of them. Jeez, that fishery was such a magnificent find. Oh my gosh, I love that place. Maybe it's all respawned by now as well. Well, I don't know. Our house hasn't. It does regenerate, doesn't it, after a period of time? I think so. Okay, let's deposit this back in here. We can throw the majority of our... Well, you know what? Let's throw the majority of our everything I'm in right there. behind you. Right? What do you want me to carry? Okay. How about we just stash all of this? Here, let me move my my keyboard a bit so I can rapidly, like, slam the E button. Oh. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Ilya, her mouth is agape at the, the sheer speed at which I've slammed my E button. Okay. And then here, let's also just stash all of it. There we go. We'll just rapid fire all this shit in there. We'll skip ones if we can. Jazz Bay grapes, those. Okay. Let's keep like half of these. There we are. Because it'd be easier even if we went like ultra mega super speed. Like we could very easily just flip back over here and choice pick out the ones that we want to keep, right? Okay, good. It worked out quite well. <laughs> All right, here. Should we take something off of Ilya right to sell? You. What do I you think want so, because she's carrying around a bunch of our potions that we want to sell off, right? Yeah, look at all these. Poison of Damage Magicka Regen. We'll sell all this shit off. Wonderful. Can I still move? Oh, you shit. Need, I'll follow. Ilya, I'm a fool. I've got your back. What do you want me to carry? All right. And then... Let's get rid of... Ooh, no, we want to keep that. That is actually useful to us. Let's get okay, going, then. good. Good, good, good. Now, let's go and sell off some of these potions real quick at Bellathor's, and then we'll be off on our way. Wait, I know Whoa. you. Yep, I'm the Dragonborn, baby. <laughs> I well, wave at him as I run by. There we are. Got something for just about everybody in here. Check it out. I've got some weird-ass potions. For Take a look. I don't know what you do with these, man, but I'm glad you buy them. There we go. And what else? Some of these. Do we have any that are worth like 50? Let's see, value. 57-ish. Oh. Well, I can't get rid of those. Aversion to fire? Eh, yeah, we'll get rid of it. I like this because not only does it make them weaker to poison, but it applies the poison. Alright. This kind of shit right here? <laughs> I'm too dumb for this. <laughs> Not until we're reliably, like, we have, like, the, uh, what do you call it? The, oh my gosh. Holy fuck, what is it called? The, not the Eye of Azura. Azura's Star, yeah. Once we have Azura's Star, we'll more rapidly make use of our enchantments and stuff. Right? Or once we hit 100 enchanting, whichever happens first, we'll start using our soul gems for the purpose of recharge. You come back. Because I'm fairly certain you get more XP by... Crafting new shit rather than recharging, right? Heard Just as it was in all the prior Dawn games. Vampire. Okay. Let me know if you up see anything here, like. and we'll sell a couple pieces of garbage off to you. What do you need, my friend? Ah, so you're an alchemist then? Let's see. Get rid of these. Whew, she does not have much. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. Okay, good. I guess that'll have to do for now, right? I don't think any of these folks out here, do they do deal in general the goods? All I can think about is my son, oh, my soul. Of you don't. They say that he was killed, but I... Oh, God. Those battle-born, they're in with the Imperials. They know it, too. And yet they lie to my very face. Oh, gosh. Here, I'm gonna... You take care <laughs> See ya! <of> yourself, <laughs> we'll be back later! <laughs> you know what's wrong with Yep, I remember. We'll, we'll do that. Yeah, we still also have to... Do the, oh, what do you call it? What was the quest? Find the missing woman or whatever? That one? We still need to do that as well. 
<laughs> Don't worry, I haven't forgotten. We'll we'll definitely absolutely take care of it. I just have my itinerary is so full. Jeez. Oh, look, see here, it's fixed itself. Ah. If only the waters outside of Morthal were the same. Oh look, the Khajiit caravan. They'll take my stupid ass potions, won't they? Now them, I really have no idea what they would do with it, but I have an absolutely firm belief in the idea that they would find a use for it. Okay. Are you the traitor? Strange sight. The white flakes that sometimes fall from the sky. Khajiit as wares, if you have coin. A peaceful greeting. You're the traitor. Need something? All right. Look. There we go, and let's dump off some weird potions, huh? There we go. And... Great. Okay, cool. Do you have anything good that I would want to actually buy? Hmm. Because sometimes, you know, they, they carry with them, like, a an oddity or so that we would very much enjoy having. Like some of these extreme healing potions, perhaps. You know what? Let's get them. A cure disease potion as well. Yeah, there we are. That seems great. Anything else here? Some moon sugar. All these weird ass items from the trinkets and curios pack. Oh, you know what? I totally forgot to claim the most recent one. I should really do that. What a grave mistake on my behalf. Okay, let's see. Let's sell off just a few more things here, because look, your gold supplies have gone back up, thanks to myself. Okay. Let's see, have we gotten it all? Yeah, we want to sell off these as well, right? Regen faster. No, these are all boons. Hmm. I mean, when am I gonna use it? I'll sell it off. There we go. May your road lead you to warm sands. Thanks, dude. You too. I'm just gonna go over here and grab one of these horses real quick. <laughs> okay. Sneak on over this direction. Back here. Still no straw, huh? All right. You know what? If we get seen, so be it. What are you gonna do? Catch me? What are you gonna do? <laughs> I took the horse. It's mine now. Let's head on back to White Run. Er, not White Run, but, uh, you know, Riverwood. Over here. So far, no fucking dragons as of late. Happy about that, right? Jeez. There we go. Back up into the wonderful, beautiful looking pines. Oh, gosh. And all the misty mountains in the distance. You can practically smell the dew on the little pine needles. You can envision it as if it were some sort of nature documentary. Oh, beautiful. Man, we've said it so many times, but it it bears repeating. Skyrim still looks pretty good, right? I mean, when you get down into the details, the fidelity starts to lose its strength, but holy shit. It's still, like, just the placement of, of everything the working of the colors and shit. Yeah, it's still, uh... It still plays its wondrous tricks on me. Oh, look. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, they're escorting a prisoner. Okay. A fight. Whoa, do me? Or, help. oh, some, like, wolf yalons. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, they're coming in for the kill! Ugh! Ugh! Look at me! Mountain Blade! <laughs> oh shit! Oh! Mountain Blade! Mountain Blade! There we go. Ilya, who are you fighting? Oh shit. It's a saber cat over yonder. Okay, can I loot a little friend there? No, I can't. Alright. Well, let's get out of this. There we are. Cool. Man, they might come all the way to River Riverwood by the time we're done speaking around here, right? Okay. Oh, it's been so long since we were last here. Holy shit, what was the last thing we even did? I don't even know. <laughs> Maybe Sven finally made it back too. <laughs> He's been walking on the road for so long. Where did we even ditch him at? Riverwood, right? Or not, um, 
<laughs> Riften. Jeez, I'm getting all my R's mixed up in a major way. Oh, fuck. Oh my gosh, do you think Sven could... Can Sven be a steward? Oh, we need to find Sven. Where is Sven? Could Sven be a steward? Oh shit, where is he? Is he still staying with his mom? No. Well, he probably is, but he's not in there right now. Let's see. Sven, is this you out here? No, My these are children and dog. Buddy. Let's get some meat. Hey, watch All right. it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Is Sven in here playing his music? Come on in. Let me know if you need anything. Or oh, where is Sven? Oh, <gasps> yes! Sven, guess what? Oh, I have a beautiful place! This property that you, you're you wanting to move out of with your mom? Leave her behind here? You know, leave her to herself? Guess what, Sven? Good day, friend. Keeping well? Oh, no! I can't get him to come with? Oh, shit. Do I need to ask him to follow me first? Hmm. Until next Are we time. going to need to do some, like, really quick shit? All right. Here. Ilya? Still here. Time for us to part ways. When you walk out that door, Ilya, you better not, like, instantly war witch warp away. I'll head back home if you need me. Okay, please walk there. Please, Ilya. All right, Sven. You look like a traveler. Follow me. I need Lead your help. The way. Let's see. I'm and Sven. right behind you. Huh. No, I can't get him to do it. Oh, shit. Is there somewhere I can buy fresh supplies? lucan has got a little bit of everything. If you need weapons or armor, see oh, Alvin man. the blacksmith. What determines whether or not someone can be your... your steward or whatever? All right, what is it? Huh. What do you need? All right. Jeez. Well, it's time for us to part I'll ways. I'll head back home if you need me. Okay, good. <laughs> good luck, Sven. <laughs> Let's see. Ilya, are you... please still be out here. Oh god, where is she gone? Is that her on the road? Oh no, where is she gone? Ilya, come back! Come back, Ilya! I wanted to send him to the murder swamp, Ilya! Oh, God. Where is she gone? Oh, I really don't want to have to quick load it. Is she back over on this road? No, because wouldn't she leave th through this path? Out the southerly route and travel through the fucking mountains? Oh, she probably just teleported away. Oh, shit. All right, let's do a quick load here. There we go. Look, we were very careful and sure about doing it. Okay, so let's get our room here. Oh, look, You're we have to talk to Delphine. Poking around. Well, not recently. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. All right, well, I'd like to rent the attic room. By the way, there have been... I asked before, and there were a few people who were wonder, who, uh, when I asked, said that they have never played Skyrim before. And that they've never seen anyone else play it. And that this was like their first experience. Or something along those lines. If you're completely unfamiliar with this. Who do you think did it? I'm very curious who you think left the note. It is someone that we have met before. It is someone that we have met before. Either, either as like a major person that we've had a lot of run-ins with. Or someone quite minor. But it is definitely someone that we have met before. I'm very curious to hear what, what you would have to say because and and no 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 shame at all in getting it wrong, because certainly I it blew me away just as well when it when it was revealed to me. Anyway, I'd like to rent the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. This but is you can have the one favorite. on the left. One of the first Make yourself at home. Learned. Ragnar the Red. Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. Okay, okay. And the braggart did I guess we'll just go on over here, huh? As he told of both battles the corn's All right. But then do I just chill out here? What do I have to do? Let's see. After demonstrating my... Unfortunately, when I reached the tomb, I found that someone had replaced the horn of Jürgen Windcaller with a note. Okay, we don't actually need to sleep and rest. Here, we'll actually eat some salmon steak here. There we are. Good, good, good. All right. Oh my god, it's Ilya. She's, she's the one who did it. <laughs> she used her witch magic to teleport just ahead of me and stayed right outside. Oh god! 
What? I it was Delphine all along? We need to talk. Follow me. When his ugly red head rolled around on okay. the floor. Okay. Ilya's really making this complicated. <laughs> Sorry, hey, Ilya. Sorry. Okay. Let's see. We do need to return the horn to Arn gear. Let's see. Oh, jeez. But also, we should speak to Delphine because she's here right now, right? She's right in front of us. Okay. Pretty weird that she would have me want to rent the attic room just to look like a complete dangus. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, what if we read that and we just thought, whoever wrote this is mad. They've lost their mind to Sheogorath. We know that there's no attic room here. <laughs> I totally know. Close the door. Oh, okay. Ilya. Come on in here, Ilya. Ilya, come on. Come in here, Ilya. Come on, close the door. Oh, gosh. Ooh, Ilya has done her witch teleport. Okay. There we go. Now we can <gasps> talk. Man, look at that. How's that for some pathing, scripting action? Oh, my God. This totally blew my mind back in the day. <laughs> I was like, this has been here the whole time? Inside the fucking wall? Oh. Hey. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. You're the one who took the horn? Sorry, I'm supposed to be meeting someone here. <laughs> we just have, we're like, uh, hey, I'm supposed to, someone with the horn of Jorgen Windcaller? <laughs> she, she even gave us the horn, didn't she? She gave us the horn and we had an update to go take it back to them. <laughs> we have to pick this. I hope you're just playing dumb. <laughs> I'm the one who left the note in Ustengrav. <laughs> she, should, she, should, she should say, I fucking gave you the horn! It was me! It was me, Delphine! <laughs> I was expecting someone taller. What's with all the cloak and dagger? Oh, well, here I am. What do you want? <laughs> that seems even also more clueless. Let's say that. Here I am! <laughs> I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Okay, yeah, I love this horn. This is like my favorite fucking horn. Go on, I'm listening. You'd better start explaining fast. This was my favorite horn. I don't have time for this. I need to tend to my favorite horn. Go on, I'm listening. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. <gasps> well, someone like you for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. How has she done all this, like, wild-ass spy work? But she has missed the fact that I am pretty much Dragonborn. I've killed, like, so many dragons! Jeez, I've killed so many of them! I can shout at you right here and right now! <laughs> I don't need to prove anything to you, I'm done here. How do I know I can trust you? Why did you take the horn from Ustengrav? Why are you looking for a dragonborn? Who said the Thalmor are after you? Or you said the Thalmor are after you? Why'd you take the horn? I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent and not some Thalmor plant. Couldn't she have just waited up at the top of the mountain? rather than go through the terrifying dungeon? I don't know. <laughs> Delphine, what you're doing, you're breaking some dragons, it's gotta be said. <laughs> How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Oh, I mean, that much has already been pretty evident that I am a fool. Why are you looking for a dragonborn? We remember what most don't. That the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. Oh, damn, the ultimate dragon slayer. the dragon only slayer. one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Devouring can its soul. It? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> yes, that's how I first learned I was Dragonborn. I absorbed some kind of power from dragons. That's all I can say. That's none of your business. <laughs> yeah, I absorbed some kind of power. This is no time to play the reluctant hero. You either are or aren't Dragonborn. But I'll see for myself soon enough. Hmm. Why are you looking for a Dragonborn? 
You said that the Thalmor are after you? Are after you? Yes. We're very old enemies. How old are you? If my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. Ilya, she's a vampire. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. I definitely am. I can scream and shout at you. I can do it. So what's the part you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. Okay. Do you know how crazy this sounds? What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. <gasps> and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Honestly, I'm surprised no one, like, dug up their ancient burial grounds and made fucking sweet-ass armor and swords out of their out of their bones, right? I mean, maybe the scales would have, like, deteriorated by them, but the bones, they're a little bit hardier. Well, maybe even the scales would have been there. I don't know how dragons work, but why didn't anyone dig that shit up and start making dragon shit out of it, right? Huh. People are missing out. <laughs> how did you figure this all out? Here, let's go with this. You know how crazy this sounds? A few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. Yeah, you, you should have acted. How did you figure all this out? You should know. You got the map for me from Bleak Falls Barrow. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, down in the Geralds near Riften. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Hmm. So where are we headed? Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Oh god, I hope she can, like, teleport me there. Okay. <laughs> you know, maybe I'm not ready to go yet. Jeez. Let's see. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, let's go kill a dragon. I Why need not? to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Can you, like, tele telewarp me? What is this? Map of dragon burials. Well, oh, oh, I took it. Hope you didn't that's need better. that. Let's get on the road to Kynesgrove. Oh, by the way, that's my friend Ilya. She's a witch. We killed her mom. She's just chilling out. She's been, you know, taking it all in here. <laughs> can we take all this stuff? Yeah, we can just take this. All right, anything else here? Oh, look, a giant's toe. Amazing. Oh, look, we'll take some of these restoratives. You've got the end till I get back. Right. Happy trails. Oh God, she's going very quickly, Ilya. Oh geez. Here, do I have something I can de? Let's see. Yeah, I do. These robes. Beautiful. Destroy it and learn it. Cool. And we should be able to move now, right? Yeah. Good. All right. Hang on, Delphine. Jeez. Huh. Here we go. All right. How far away is Kynes Grove? Isn't Kynes that Grove over is by? This way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Oh, let's travel together. Do you need something? Let's see. Where are we headed? Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Okay. What's so important about me being dragonborn? Dragons are coming back, and you're a born dragon slayer. That's all you need to know right now. Okay. Well, how do you know where the dragons will come back? The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. Right. I've looked at which ones are now empty. <laughs> the pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast. Down in the Geralds near Riften. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Who are the Thalmor? The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. Mm. So why are they hunting you? We hurt them in the past, and they have long memories. 
All right. Is it really that they have long memories or also that because, you know, they're elves, they just, they live for pretty long. <laughs> let's get going. Okay, let's get going. How far is this place? Oh, God. Hold up. Oh, no, this isn't it. Oh, my God, it's all the way up here? Holy shit, Delphine, I don't... <laughs> Maybe I'll meet you there, Delphine. I might just meet you there. I'll take the carriage from Whiterun up there. If my analysis is correct, the dragon buried near Kynesgrove will be the next to come back to life. Okay. Oh, dear God. Wait, does she ever talk while, while we're traveling with her? Oh, shit, she's really not that fast at all, is she? Okay. Oh, here we go. All right. We'll see if she says anything interesting to us while we... Come on, we... we've got to get to Kynesgrove. Yeah, yeah, we do. Jeez, this'll take a bit, huh? <laughs> all right. Sure. Oh, look, the beautiful birds flying around. I love it. Good. Jeez. Look. Oh, God! Stop right there. Delphine, come back! Whoa, what the fuck? Who is this man? Oh my god! <laughs> He's a wizard! <laughs> uh. Uh. Brrr. Let's see. How, how about you? Whoa, Delphine, there's a bunch of stuff happening. I'll pay you. Look the other way. I, I gotta go kill a dragon! Everything here appears to be in order. <laughs> we can move along now. Delphine! What the, this man! He appeared out of nowhere right before my eyes! Gosh, it's like I'm in Cyrodiil again. <laughs> I never left. Good God. He really just materialized right there. Delphine, did you see that? Jeez, you were wondering if I was an agent of the Thalmor. I think that fucking guy was. <laughs> that guy was... He was really an agent. Did you see him appear? He, he was using his stealth. <laughs> that, that's, that's exactly how it appears when we use our stealth. And people are like, oh, I can't see anyone. Ilya, Agents of the Thalmor! Delphine! Agents! Agents of the Thalmor! I've seen them! I hope They're I everywhere! Really <laughs> They're gonna get us! Soon enough. Delphine, they're tailing our ass! There's all sorts of bad shit happening! <laughs> what are the chances that on the fucking road there, we would run into them? <laughs> That's so fucking funny. <laughs> Are there any other random encounters where... Yes, I'm a spy of the Thalmor. Ah, I'm here. I've heard that you are the Dragonborn. I'm here to fuck dead, you up. <laughs> but at least it gets me out of Riverwood. I don't really think I'm cut out for the quiet life. Oh, okay. Jeez. What are you doing? Oh, okay. I thought you were about to jump off into the water. Holy shit, Delphine. All right. Let's keep going over. Jeez, this is going to be such a fucking run and a half, huh? Yep. She's also playing on survival mode. Also, having a wild-ass time. She should have stolen a horse or something. Delphine. Come on, I know we're both on survival mode here, but, you know, hot tips. We should hit up, uh, the should carriage. Pick somebody oh. else for your dinner. Oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> Not quite good enough, huh? Okay. Let's see. She is saying a little bit to us while we're like en route, en route. Oh great, who is this? Good. I can use the practice. <laughs> Delphine! It's an assassin! <laughs> it's a literal assassin! It's oh no, Ilya, don't don't kill her! <laughs> we're finding so much stupid shit. <laughs> this is honestly incredible. <laughs> there we go. Knock ya. Good. Look at Delphine. What a fucking tank and a half. Jeez. Good job, Delphine. Holy fuck. Alright. Let's see. What's this note? Oh no. They want to kill me. Of course. I can't believe the assassin wanted to do that. Should we put some virulent fear poison on our shit or just pick it up? Let's just pick it up. Hang on, Delphine. I have to give my this ebony sword to my friend here. She carries everything for me. Oh, Ilya, please. No, don't go the other way, Ilya. 
I've got your back. Let's what trade do you some want shit. Me to carry? There we go. Take all this and why not some of these? There we are. Okay. That's good enough for now, huh? Yeah. Let's get going then. Alright. <sighs> Sorry, Delphine. Alright. Let's be on the way. Jeez. Ilya, I think uh I think someone does want me dead though. <laughs> <laughs> what else could we run into that would be- Wow, okay, now a bear? Oh no, it's a Thalmor spy, or <laughs> Delphine. Whatever will we do? Sorry, Delphine, I keep <laughs> calling you Ilya. <laughs> it's it's become a habit, you know. I've been traveling with Ilya for what feels like a millennia, but, uh, hey, you know, it is what it is. What can you do? Oh, man. Delphine is fucking powerful as shit. All right. Let's take the bear claw. Delicious. All right. <laughs> Good God, this is gonna take forever, huh? Jeez. Let's see. How far away are we now? Eh, we're about halfway. A little under half. Something like that. Delphine, you gonna say anything else of interest while we're running out here? Or was this actually just like a massive mistake? <laughs> Delphine, where are you going? <laughs> let's do you see. need something? Anything else? Nope. Okay, fair let's enough. Let's get going. Yep, let's get going. Let's do it. I'm ready. I think she runs this route no Remember, matter what, right? We're not looking for trouble. We need to get to Kynes Grove as fast as we can. I know, Delphine. I'm not looking for trouble, but there were like Thalmor agents. Some guy tried to arrest me for probably stealing a horse. He may have followed me all the way here, cloaked in a shroud of darkness. And then also someone really cloaked in Shroud of Darkness, an assassin. So we should be safe from them at least. Man. Honestly, that's kind of amazing. The sheer level of incompetence that they wouldn't be aware of me. I mean, Delphine, we really don't need to do this. Like, look look at this. Delphine, check this shit out. Look, I'm the Dragonborn. Huh? Oof! You'll have to do better than that. I did it! <laughs> she means, you'll have to do better than that. You'll have to kill a dragon. I don't believe you. <laughs> that you're not a dragonborn. I need to see it. <laughs> oh, Delphine. <laughs> what a weirdo. <laughs> okay, she's having some difficulty. I should not have shouted at her. Okay. <laughs> Literally shouted at her. <laughs> okay, here we go. Gee, she sure does take a weird-ass route. Kind of going over the hill and through the woods. Oh fuck! Are these fucking wild ass bastards back? This is a back? notorious bandit hideout. Yeah, they're but it's back. Also the shortest way to Kynesgrove, so we may have to kill a few bandits. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm I'm encumbered. All right, let's eat one of these. Oh jeez. All right. Uh, boo, 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 boo. what can I do? How about we could drink this thing of the warrior? Hmm. Or we could apply a poison. There we go. Yeah, that'll do us. Okay. Delphine! It's the bandits! Better to stick together. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Hold it. This here's a toll road, see? You're gonna Delphine, have to they're over, tolling me! Say, 200 gold if you want to use our road. What? I killed the last people who were here. How about you let me through and I don't kill you? You know, now that I think of it, that sounds fair. Just shove off before the others notice. Wow! Holy shit, it worked! <laughs> Did you see that, Delphine? Holy shit! Oh, I used... I used the voice, Delphine. <laughs> That's what that was. I channeled my Thoom. <laughs> she hates it. Alright. Very well. Wow, it's gotten very... scary looking. Delphine, this looks very foreboding. It's a, a terrible fog has set upon the land. I'm not enjoying it whatsoever. Too bad she didn't comment on the fact that, like, how fucking smoothly I defused that situation, huh? Look at me, Delphine. I'm the dragon, born dragon slayer, ultimate dragon slayer, and the ultimate mediator. <laughs> no? Okay, fair enough. Jeez, this is looking grim. What a terrible evening night. At least it's not that cold. I don't think we even go into, like, the super cold zone, right? 
when you do this little fun quest. All roads that we have tread before as well. Weirdly enough. Surprised they put it here on a road that you're likely to have traveled, right? Feel like maybe you would go somewhere different. I don't know. Cause odds are you would go this path to reach Keep a sharp lookout. Oh. We can't afford any delays. To reach the Greybeards when they call for you, right? I don't know. Delphine, a lot a lot of things about this whole plan of yours seem very, very weird. <laughs> How do I really know I, sh I can even trust you, Delphine? Oh shit, is this the place? No. Delphine, where the fuck are you going? Delphine, what are you doing? Illy, I don't... <laughs> I don't know about this. Is this how Ilya feels the whole time? <laughs> I'm just like going through like rivers, jumping off of cliffs and shit. <laughs> She's like, oh, I don't know about this guy. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Surely we'll we're almost the there. White River and follow it to Windhelm. Then we can swing south to Kynesgrove. Okay, the White River. Sure. Oh, hey. Some storm cloaks over here. Wandering right out of the woods. I guess I must have all just taken a leak over there. That's fine. That's fine. You have to imagine there must be a lot of poop on these roads, right? Horses come through. People just walking the path. They gotta poop. No one else on the road. Just pull down your pants and just start pooping while you're moving, right? I mean, what's the worst Better that could to happen? Stick together. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. I know, I did almost get killed. A literal assassin came after me. I'm amazed you didn't think that that was maybe the Thalmor. Are we really going to go off-road here, or are you... Oh, God. No? Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. <laughs> We've got some real fucking Soul Train-ass shit going on here. <laughs> yeah, Soul Train. Because we're going over to get a soul, right? Of course. Oh, Delphine, I need some Jazz Bay grapes up here. Do you happen to know where there's any? I need some of them. No? Okay. Jeez. Delphine is just all fucking business. Oh god, I can hear a dragon. Delphine, there's always a dragon like over there in the Swamps of Sorrows or whatever. Near the there's an inn geysers. At Grove, the Braidwood. I hear they serve a nice dark ale. Nothing on the sleep. There's been word of some trouble nearby. I'm on my way to investigate. Jeez, that person looked fucking scary as shit in all their ebony armor. Oh look, Jazz Bay Grapes! Perfect. Oh shit. <laughs> I take it and immediately get encumbered. Great. Okay. Let's see, is, is there any ingredient that I can just fucking chow down on? Oh jeez, I don't think so. What can we drop? Hmm. The horn. <laughs> I could drop the horn. Oh, I shouldn't do that. I should not. I guess we could... Hang on. I need to trade with Ilya. I'm right behind you. What do you want me to carry? Let's see. How about you take, like, half of my lockpicks? Because I've got so many of them. Five pounds are you units worth. Follow. There we go. Oh, look. She waited. Thanks, Delphine. Keep okay. a sharp lookout. We can't afford any delays. Delphine, I think there's a fucking dragon around. Can't you hear it? I mean, I guess maybe she can. Maybe that's why she couldn't hear when the uh, the Greybeards called for me. All right. Here we go. Jeez, jeez, jeez. I'm trying to keep a lookout for the dragon over there. Maybe together. it's a different one, in fact. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Is there a chance that we get, like, a randomly occurring dragon when we find the scripted dragon? Is that possible? Can that happen? That seems like something that could happen. Oh great, another power bear. Should've picked somebody else. Okay. Jeez, look at her go. Holy shit. Alright. Good. Let's see, bear claws. Should I take these? Yeah, I should. Why not? I can't help myself. It's against my better judgment to be picking all these flowers, but hey. What can I do? What can I fucking do? I'm glad you were willing to trust me. I know it probably wasn't the best way to introduce myself. 
but old habits. Yeah. I know, you're wanting me to run like halfway across all of Skyrim. Holy shit. Oh god, who is this? Some weird man out here. Delphine, who is this strange man? Greetings, Orc. brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax if you're interested. <laughs> Delphine, hang on. I'm gonna buy some drugs from this guy? <laughs> What are you talking about? The finest skooma, the sweetest moon sugar, at a fair price, of course. Yeah, I'll take some. Let's see. All right, then. What have you got? Take a look. Let's see. How much is it? Ooh, jeez, it's a little, a little steep. Hmm. Oh, look, we can get uh, sleeping tree sap as well from him. Should we just buy some skoom skoom? I don't know. We'll at least buy some moon sugar. Why not? There we go. I can sell off a dumbass potion as well let's see where are my other dumbass potions at hmm yeah where are they uh oh yeah we'll get rid of that one and this and these and that okay cool until next great time. <laughs> By the well, Delphine. By the way, <laughs> by the well. By the oh shit! What the fuck? Was this my doing? Are these cultists from the last time we came through? Oh, it totally is. Oh shit! <laughs> hey, look at this. There's some shit out here. Hang on, Delphine. I left some shit out out here. I totally I forgot about it. What do you want me to carry? Here we go. Let's see. Look at this. We're finding some cool ass treasures and everything. There it Let's is. Get going, then. Look, I left a little treat for myself out here in the wilderness. I've been on this road before, Delphine. There were some cultists and everything. You should talk to them. I think they they also think that I might be the dragonborn. <laughs> they might have a hunch or two just as well. Better to stick together. <laughs> I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Holy fuck, Delphine. Are we just going up into fucking Windhelm or what? What is this weird ass route we're taking? Oh god, and what is that over there? Is that like a wisp mother or something? An ice wraith? Let's see. Oh gosh. I guess we gotta swing south from here or something. Jeez, I'm gonna freeze my ass off out here, Delphine. It's very cold. I don't know about you, but I I don't Not take well to it. Kindsgrove is just down the road to the southeast of here. Okay. <laughs> I trust you. Who? What? Ilya, we lost her! Oh god! What the fuck? Where is she gone? No! Oh no! Oh, there she is. Okay. <laughs> Great. Okay. <laughs> Jeez! I thought she, like, warped all the way to the place we were meant to go. Maybe she got sucked under the bridge or something by, like, some troll or whatever. Alright. Jeez, look at this snow. It's, like, got a sheen of ice on top of it, huh? Probably not what they were going for, but that's some real shit, right? A sheen of ice on top of a layer of snow? Totally real. Good god. I'm gonna fall this over dead. Not, not much to look at. The innkeeper ought to be able to tell us if there's any dragon mound nearby. Okay. Oh, God, I can't see shit, Delphine. It's a fucking blizzard out here. Jesus, this place sucks a butt. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is a nightmare. Oh, shit. Wait, something's wrong. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. It's attacking. <laughs> A dragon is attacking Kynesgrove? Well, I don't know. Not yet. It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Uh-oh. Oh, hurry. We might be too late. Okay, we can't stop in the inn and get warmed up? Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is gonna be a little rough, huh? Okay. There we are. Quick save enabled. Come on, we need to find out what's happening up there. Okay. Come on. We need oh to shit, find I shouldn't have tried to talk to you again. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. 
All right. It looks like a dragon flying around, Delphine. Lorcan's eyes. Look at that big bastard. Look at that big bastard. <laughs> Why'd she say it like that? Why is the delivery in this area so weird? <laughs> it's attacking! Big bastard. <laughs> oh, jeez. What is this? Some weird torch here. Oh, it's a dead person. Oh, jeez. I'm taking that. Okay. I guess, is this just in case I came here completely naked? So they gave me a little bit of equipment? Alright. Hey, check this shit out, Delphine. Check this shit out. Ugh. Well, fuck. <laughs> I gave it a, my best shot. Alright. Delphine, it seems pissed. <laughs> Zeal grow Dova Ulsa. Steady. I don't know what's happening. Let's watch and wait. It's screaming at the this dirt. Is worse than I thought. It's coming out. Oh my God, Delphine, you were right. Alduin Thuri, bo antid vo grihas rixen jun kuzi. Holy shit, I'm gonna freeze to fucking death out here. Ilya. I've got your back now. What do you want me to carry? Ilya, I'm gonna freeze to fucking death. Give me a camping supply just in case. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking die out here. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, can you take some of this heavy shit? Let's see. Uh, wait. Take the moon sugar, these clusters. There we go, all this. Gotta get my carry weight down. There we go. Is that good enough? Maybe not. Let's see. Ooh. How about ooh, these soul gems? There we go. Lead on. Okay. Delphine, I have a bad feeling about this. I think I'm about to die. You do not even know our tongue, do you? Oh. Such arrogance to dare take for yourself the name of Dova. Delphine, he saw me. <laughs> he saw me, Delphine. All right. Great. <laughs> Hopefully it's a fire dragon. Oh, no, it's an ice dragon. Oh, fuck. Oh, good God. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yo, Delphine, I'm going to fucking freeze my ass off and die out here. All right. Camp, please deploy. Please. I can't do well in combat. All right, fine. Let's see. Oh, jeez. Emergency quick load. Okay. 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 Check this shit out. Check this shit out. Look, we're not in combat. Guess what we're about to do? Boom. Build a campsite here. Yes. Hang on, Alduin. Hang on. I gotta erect a, a campsite. Oh, God. What's happening? Whew. Campsites allow you to rest and stay warm while exploring the wilderness. You can cook a limited number of meals over the campsite. Your campsite is marked on your map, so you can locate and fast travel to it later. Great. Great, great, great. Oh, I'm just gonna stand on this here. Oh, God. All right. Let's see. It is a frosty dragon, so let's get our frosty resistance. Let's see here. Resist frost. 28%. I guess I'll take it, right? Do we have any other better resistance? I'm not sure. Yeah, that'll have to do. Okay. Let's see. Let's also get our friend here at the ready. Oh, we've already got her bound. Okay. Francine, need some help. Go. Good. Ah! Oh, I can take it, I can take it, I can take it. I am so here. Hear my voice. Yeah, we gotta bring it down. Alright, good. Okay, let's get our bound bow here at the ready. Okay. Uh. 
All right, I can't really move, though. I need to stand on this. I think the blizzard's going away, though. That's great. Holy shit, I hit it. Oh, my God. Look at me. Fucking eagle eyes over here. All right. Good. Oh, look, I think we're... We're fully restored from the warmth of our <laughs> emergency campsite. Oh my god. Whew. Alright. Let's see. Let's get our good shit out here. Let's engage a quick save as well. Oh shit, we are a little bit hungry as well. Let's eat some beef stew. Ah, Shazbot. All right. I'm not afraid of Fire at will. My oh, voice. shit! Oh, God! Ramming speed! Oh, my God! <laughs> Good way to just instantly kill me, I guess. Just ram your whole fucking body into me. There we are. Let's go with this. Cool. Oh, shit. All right. Let's get our friend back out again. I could use a hand here. All right. Let's hang out on top of this. Get our warmth back. My lord, Alduin requires your death. I am glad to oblige him. Okay, okay. That's great, dude. There we are. Yeah. Good. Got it. I'm not hiding, dude. I just built a little campsite. I was getting cold. Whew. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Okay. Is he on Delphine? Yeah. You think Delphine is like tanking the shit out of him? Oh fuck. Alright. This. Cool. We need to get another Francine out. As well. Okay, up here. healing. Okay. Draft of health. Extreme healing. A little bit of healing. Cool. Uh. Uh. Jeez. Okay. Let's get a whole bunch of these little ones inside of us. There we go. Oh, fucker. Alright. Dude is at like half health, so... Let's quick save over here. Flame Atronach, go! There we are. Heal on up over here manually. Good. I see the portals have become terrible. Eat a butt, dude. Good thing he ain't like fucking up with the little town or whatever. Speaking of which. Where's their guards? Oh shit, am I like mounting it? I I assume so. Something cool is probably happening right now. <laughs> I think I can see my Oh yeah, there I am. <laughs> Amazing. Look at me go, Delphine! I'm the D-born, baby! Whew! I'll be You did it! Yeah, I did it. Something's happening. God's above! Yeah, I'm sucking them off! Look at me suck them! Oh shit, yeah, look at me go. Yeah, I've done it before should have seen. I've, I've done it like at least 10 times. Listen to this. You're gonna love it. There they go. Oh yeah. You really are Dragonborn. I know. We only had to travel all the way across the fucking world and almost freeze my ass off to do it, but holy hell, I've done it.
Let's see. Should we take all these amazing things? Yeah, let's do it. All right. I owe you some answers, don't I? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> What's up? I owe you some answers, don't I? Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Oh, jeez. Who are you, and what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since Illy the last Dragonborn bored. Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. I thought it was so cool back in the day when uh, the first when it was revealed. Like, holy shit, they're the blades! I totally remember them. Let's see. Uh, what do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. I've seen that dragon before. The one that got away. Really? Where? It was the one that attacked Helgen when Ulfric escaped from the Imperials. Interesting. Same and dragon. me, I also escaped. Damn it. We're blundering <laughs> I guess around probably in the smart to not here. tell her. We need to figure out who's behind it all. Uh, the Blades. Who are they? Exactly. Nobody even remembers our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone, though. For the last 200 years, We've been searching for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. Cool. Well, what's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. R remind me? Who are the Thalmor? What makes you think the Thalmor are bringing dragons back? Why are the Thalmor after you? I guess we may as well exhaust this. Remind me, who are the Thalmor? The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to right, humankind right. Okay, we'll just skip this. What makes the you Empire think the Thalmor are bringing dragons back? Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The I mean, Empire they are pretty bad. Captured Ulfric. <laughs> the war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? All right, well, we definitely already asked that, didn't we? Why are the Thalmor after you? Well, let's see, maybe she has something new. Before the Great War, the Blades helped the Empire against the Thalmor. Hmm. Our Grand Master saw them as the greatest threat to Tamriel. At the time, that was true. Maybe it still is. So we fought them in the shadows, all across Tamriel. We thought we were more than a match for them. We were wrong. So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Any ideas? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. So how do we get into the Thalmor Embassy? Mm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Very cool. Yeah, and she does actually run all the way fucking back, doesn't she? <laughs> so wild. All right. Here, Ilya, can you carry some I've of this dragon back. shit? What do you want me to carry? Let's see here. How about all these? Oh, wow. Good job. Holy hell. Let's get going, then. <sighs> Is there anything left up inside of this? Man, not much, uh... Not much shit in there, right? Jeez. Oh look, Stormcloak Soldier. Another one, or the same one from before? I think it's another one. Weird. Okay. I guess maybe the idea is that there are no guards at Kynesgrove because they all got killed. Doing this shit, right? Trying to defend. Makes sense. 
All right. Wow. Holy shit. Good thing we had the the camp with us because we would have died for sure. We maybe could have like futzed around with the continuity of the quest and like jumped inside of a house in Kindsgrove <laughs> and warmed up that way before we sh did a big show down here. Right? Because it seemed like the blizzard was just about to go away. Right? So maybe we could have gone and done all that if we were willing to fuck around. We could have done it without needing to deploy a campsite, right? But hey, there it is. Our first campsite deployed. And you know what? I'm willing to blame it on the, uh, <laughs> on the quest. <laughs> Though maybe we could have left during the night. That way we would have gotten here during, um, like the evening of the following day. Maybe? I don't know. All right. Well, I was going to read the final bit of the bestiary, bestiary. But, uh, oh God, is there another one? But, you know what? It's gonna have to wait. <laughs> when next we come back, we gotta turn in the horn and all that shit, right? Until next time, please take care of each other. <laughs>